So today I wanted to film another makeup tutorial for you guys. This is going to be a full face and I'm going to be using the Naked Heat palette. But to start off with, we're going to go ahead and start with a primer. So I'm going to use the Professional Benefit Primer on my face. And I'm just going to use my fingers to rub that in. So I'm going to get low on it, so I'm going to have to get some more of this soon. So I'm just going to use my fingers to blend all that in. And I've done some self tanning, so I'm actually going to switch up the foundation I've been using for a lot of videos. Because I'm hoping that I'm dark enough for it now. So I'm actually going to be using the IT um, color CC Plus foundation in light. I'm just going to put that on a beauty blender and then I'm just going to dot that over my face and blend it. So I'm not sure if it's the right color but I'm hoping that it is. I'm actually going to play around and darken up this self tanner a little bit today so I'm hoping that if it's not the right color now, it'll be the right color once I darken it up some. I keep forgetting with this, since I haven't been using it as much, that a little bit of this actually goes quite a long way. So it can take a little while to blend it in if you put on too much. So I'm kind of going to go with my hands and just kind of blend some of the areas where there's a little too much a little bit better because I'm finding the beauty blender is just not getting some of the areas. Alright, so once I've got that blended, still looking a little bit yellowy, but it's okay, we're just going to go with it. Um, the next thing that I'm going to do is use my NYX HD Photogenic Concealer. And I'm just going to put that under my eyes and on any spots or places I want to lighten up a little bit. So this should help me lighten up that yellowing a little bit on the foundation. And it also will add like a little bit of highlight in those areas. And then of course under the eyes it's just going to be covering my dark circles. Now that that's done, let's go ahead and get into the eyes. So for the name of this video, obviously, I'm actually going to start with the color Scorched right here. So I'm going to put that on the lid. You really do not need a whole lot of this because it is very pigmented. So I'm probably only going to do this one layer of it, because I just I feel like that's enough. I know that this is a little messy, I'm going to clean that up in a second. The next thing that I'm going to do is actually go ahead and go in with He Double right here, and I'm going to use that to blend out. Now I'm going to kind of use my fingers to go around this, just to kind of clean up the edges just a little bit. And then I'm just going to blend just a little bit more. Next up, I'm going to take a smudger brush, and I'm going to go ahead and take the color Infuaga, and just put that under the eyes. I'm only going to go halfway with this, you can go further if you would like. I just feel like on my eyes personally, halfway looks better. So 
so after that, I'm going to take a slanted Luxie brush, and I'm going to take ounce and use that to highlight. So it's going to go on my brow bone and then the inner corners. Once that's done, I'm going to go ahead and take my It by My Pores Press Powder, and I'm just going to use that all over my face. And that as well will help lighten up the yellow a little bit of that foundation. So after that, I'm trying to decide which bronzer I want to go in with. Since I have on the darker foundation, I think I'm just going to use the Rimmel Natural Bronzer. So I'm just going to take that on a Real Techniques brush and just kind of use that um, to add just a little bit of bronzing, a little bit more of a deeper color to this look. After that, I'm going to do highlighter. So I'm going to take the High Beam um, Highlighter by Benefit and I'm just going to put that on my face. Now I'm just going to use my fingers to blend that in. So after that, I'm going to do my brows. So I'm going to go in with the Benefit Give Me Good Brow, and I'm just going to run that through my brows. After that, I'm going to do mascara. So I'm going to be using the Marcel Extension Plus Curl Mascara. And I'm just going to run that through my tops and my bottom lashes. And last but not least, I'm going to do lips. So I've been loving the NYX Whip Fuet. So I'm just going to put that on my lips. And this is in Pink Cloud. So this, you guys, is the finished look. I'm really loving looks like this right now, so I wanted to show you guys this this week. I know the pink lip doesn't necessarily go with this top, so for this top, I probably should have gone with like a more nudie lip. But anyways, I really like this look. I've been wearing it a ton, so I just wanted to share it with you guys. If you guys enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and let me know what you think in the comments, and I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys!